Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing a Walmart clothing haul. This was supposed to be a Shein haul. I ordered a bunch of stuff about a month ago. It came in, it just wasn't good. I ordered a bunch of like lounge sets and things like that and they really weren't, the fit wasn't good, the fabric. So I went to Walmart, my tried and true, and got a bunch of really good basics, things that I could wear every day. Just comfortable, easy, mix and match stuff. If you don't know, I work from home about six hours every day. I do carpool two hours a day. And I'm also running in and out of stores filming videos for you guys. So I want really comfortable, easy things that I could just throw on, feel good, but still look put together. So if you like these kind of videos, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you're new. And let's get on with the haul. Okay, so the first thing I picked up is a little jacket from No Boundaries. We're starting to get some cooler weather here in Florida, and I don't have anything like this that it could be dressed up, dressed down, casual leggings, jeans, and still really cute. And I don't have anything in this camel color, so I wanted to put some of this in my wardrobe, and I just thought it was really cute with like the black stitching. You could do black jeans, black leggings, and denim, and just still look like put together. I also like that it has that little pocket there. So lots of pockets, that one in the front and then on the side. That's what the inside looks like. So just the same as outside, it's not lined. So I got my normal size medium in this one and I think it's a good fit. I wouldn't size up or down. And the price on this was $16.96. Then the next thing I picked up is from Athletic Works. It's just a basic black sweatshirt with the hood and the kangaroo pockets. This says that it is like extra warm and super soft. This doesn't feel so thick to me. I haven't worn it yet, but that's what the material looks like on the inside. So it doesn't look so thick like that I'd be super hot in it. But I think this was like $14 and change. Just an easy black hoodie, comfortable throw it on with jeans and boots or I got the matching joggers I'll show you them next leggings printed pants colors so lots of stuff I want to be able to wear with that and then to go with it I got the matching joggers also from athletic works they were in like the same display area these were $12 and change so not bad for the set less than $30 and you have the matching joggers. And I liked the bottoms on these. So that's what that looks like. They really have a nice cut to them too. The back has that seam that goes around that kinda gives you some shape. And they have the drawstring that you can actually tighten it if you get a little oversized or you need some more room in the legs and put smaller waist you can tie it tighter which is always good. The next thing I picked up is from the brand Time and True. It's the Sherpa baseball cap. It was $7.97. It does have an adjustable band here. So I know you can make it super tight. Um, I have a bigger head, so mine is like almost like it has. Wait, actually there's a lot more room. So really one size fits all. And then you can make it super small. You might have a little bit of a puffiness in the back, but if you have like a lot of hair, uh, that'll look cute. But I just thought this would be really cute with the black jogger outfit. Sometimes my hair is a hot mess and I've been throwing it up in a bun lately, but I feel like throwing a cap on is a better option. And I thought this Sherpa one was really cute. I've been looking for a Sherpa headband like this. So if you see one, make sure you let me know. And then the next thing I got is another like easy, comfy pair of leggings. These are their flared leggings. I know like when I was younger, we called them yoga pants, but that's the new name for them. Um, so they have a really wide bottom and then they're pretty slim. These are really soft. They're that microfiber material. I liked this tie dye kind of look. Believe it or not, I'm not sick of the tie-dye yet. I feel like I'm always like kind of sick of it. And then I'll go in a store and I'll see a bunch of stuff I like. And I'm like, nope, I'm not sick of it. 
so these I did size up to a large in and I don't feel like I know in one of my videos I don't know what happened in the comment I know it popped up about like saggy butt and the leggings um, with the no boundaries ones, I don't think that happens. Time and true, you could if you size up or if you get like your normal size. Sometimes I do feel like there is a kind of awkward shape. But these really stick to you and um, I don't think it matters if you size up. They're really inexpensive too. They were $7.88. There's basic black. There's so many prints. Camo. There's a denim that I saw. The denim, I'm not really sure about. I mean, it kind of looks like a free people pair that I saw but also could be on the fence of like looking kind of cheap so I don't know I didn't really was kind of thinking about it but maybe I'll go back I don't know we'll see the next thing has been around for a while I showed you guys this in a couple of videos and I finally got around to picking it up just because we really haven't had a cold winter here in Florida and I didn't need so many sweaters so many sweatshirts so many like cardigans but now we are getting cooler weather. So I picked up this from Secret Treasures. This is like almost an exact dupe for last year's Barefoot Dreams Raglan tops. So they even did the same colors. I don't know why no one really even says anything about this. But they're the same. They have that gray, like a maroon color blue and then a tan and I do remember like slightly barefoot dreams having like very similar colors so this one they call black but it really looks gray to me it has the kangaroo um pockets that's what the fabric looks like so very very similar to the cozy light in the barefoot dreams that's the material it's not like the thicker one but I just thought this was cute. I got the matching set to this too. But you could wear this with jeans and boots. And just be really cozy. Leggings. Like any colored like pants or denim. That's what I want to do with that too. So that's so good. And I think that's like an in-store purchase only. But I'll link it down below. Hopefully you guys could find them if you like them. Oh, and they are on sale for 7 Each piece is $7. That's another thing that made me want to get them. So, the, here's the joggers. Like I said, very similar to the Barefoot Dreams. This is the bottoms. I haven't tried these on yet, so I can't really talk about sizing. Secret Treasures is weird. Sometimes I'm true to size. Usually things run a little big, but once in a while their pants run small. So I don't know, hopefully these work. I got my normal size medium in both the top and the bottoms because they didn't have too many sizes. So I'm really excited about these. These, like I've seen a lot of outfits on Pinterest with these and a white tee and a denim jacket or just like a long sleeve white tee like tied up. Um, so you don't have to wear like the whole outfit together. But it's still just like a really cute piece, I think. And then to go with that set, I got another baseball cap. And I showed on my community tab my favorites from the Walmart shop with me. And this was on there. So this was also $7.97 from Time and True. And it's just a gray leopard that says love. I think it's perfect. I always like Valentine's Day themed things around like January, February. But this is cute to wear all around, I think. Even if you wear like the all black outfit with this the gray um, I, don't know, I just liked it and then the next thing I got is from no boundaries I think yeah I got a medium sometimes when I'm in the store I don't even realize I'm just so used to buying mediums that no boundaries sometimes are in small so I didn't even try this hopefully it looks good and it's not too tight but I think with cardigans you really can't go wrong with sizing if you size up down or get your right size but this one I thought was really pretty with the blue and the purple. I really, really liked the other colors in this. It's very free people um, print. I saw like a couple things from this year that they did with this like blue and tan and orange. But orange looks so bad on me that I just wanted to get colors that would complement my skin tone. And sometimes you have to do that. Like if it's going to look bad on you, then... Even if you love it, like why even bother? So I just got the colors I know. Like if I'm cool toned, I know that those colors are going to work on me. So I just, 
I don't know, there was blue in that too, so maybe it would look good. I don't know, we'll see. If I like that enough, I'll go back and get the other one. And then I just got a plain white tee to go under it. I don't have any good white tees. I really need to go shopping for all of like those kind of basics, like tees, tanks, and all that. But I haven't really seen things that I really love. All of the last year, I did like a whole big shop from Abercrombie, and a lot of this stuff kind of just didn't wash good, so I didn't want to do that again. And before that, I would always go to H and M, and their stuff kind of looked like I didn't like the way it looked in pictures like the way the tees and stuff looked so I'm trying to find like another good brand so these are like so affordable can't think how much it was I think it four dollars so just easy and Target too is good sometimes but I think that their fitting is sometimes awkward too and then the last thing I picked up is another pair of these three button jeans. So this is my third pair now. I have the black coated, the camo, and now these pink ones. So they have three buttons. They're supposed to be high waisted, but to me they come up like right maybe, like right at my belly button. So more of like a mid rise, but I do have a long torso. And I've said this a couple of times, you wanna size up at least one in these. They are really small cut like especially in this area they're really small they're smaller in the waist and then also in the back and i think with this like light colored denim you definitely want to size up at least one or two because you'll definitely see like any lumps and bumps and now that i'll be 40 this year um that's more of an issue i think so I'm excited about these. I think this with even like the black sweatshirt I could wear it with. And then even this like Barefoot Dreams top will look cute with like gray boots, a white sweater, the white tee, and a denim jacket. So sometimes you pick up a pair of pants like this color and you're like, what am I gonna wear with it? And I feel like just in this haul, I have a couple outfits. So I'm excited about this. They do say they're cropped and I would say they're about a 27 inch and seem so more of like an ankle. They do come rolled up too. So they came like that and you can easily just roll, unroll them if you don't want them to be that short. But I don't think they're that, I don't, I wouldn't say they're like a capri, more of an ankle length and they're $15 and 98 cents. Okay, so that's it for this haul. Thank you so much for watching. Give it a thumbs up if you liked it, and don't forget to subscribe. Bye.